have we here? Ah, the traveler, of course. Wallace said, yes, uh, right on time. Sorry you had to see that. But then again, you've been around. I'm sure you know, families fight, Andrew Ford. Good to make your acquaintance. <laughs> I guess my reputation precedes me. I'm sure you've got a lot of questions, and I've got a favor to ask. So let's get to it. You first. That's a longer story than I can indulge right now. Let's keep it to this. You know how some things you drink can make you drunk, and some things you eat can make you sick or sleepy? Well, other things do this. Huh. Huh, <laughs> huh. Not my way. And you want to be careful what you wish for, traveler. Ah, uh, not you precisely, as in name, rank, serial number. But I knew someone was coming. Aren't you clever? Skeptic. That's fine. It so happens I knew you'd be coming today. Or I hoped. Our young Wallace told me. Wallace? He's a special kid. A lot like somebody I used to know. She had bad dreams, too. Dreams about things that hadn't yet come to pass. It's more like he can see really far into the present. Sometimes. Oh, nothing too dangerous. I've got to marshal my resources. And then we'll get into it in earnest. All right, Traveler. Now that you've shot your shot, here's mine. I need an able young scrapper to help an old man out. Talk to Wally. You'll find him out by the docks. After that, gear up. And then meet me at the ward gate. I'll tell you a story. <laughs> I'm not talking about this right now. Greetings. Forgive me. I am not good with Paxel Tech faces. Ooh. It is new. I thought I had seen it before. So difficult to tell Pax to take a part without hoof and horn. I am Sa Israk Thadwell. Uh, my Pax will take name is... I sell crystals from... On... Farewell. Talk to Wally. <laughs> He'll set you right. That's okay. I'll be Mr. Ferguson this time. enough first time for everything all right new kid let me save you some time my work happens to be tinkering and modding weapons <sighs> look pisses me off when people come by and interrupt my meat so I'll make you a deal 
You find anything? Oh, and if you tell anyone, I... See you, Traveler. You're the one Ford's been waiting for. Though, he doesn't know he's been waiting. You know. And you don't. Sorry, I shouldn't say. I'm Wallace. Did I say that yet? Probably. You have a path to walk. You choose the first step here. Yep. That makes a lot of sense now. You're right, of course. Your path is waiting. Tell Brabus and McCabe I sent you. They have what you need. Then the next step on your... Until next time. Talks to the root? <laughs> I don't trust Wally with a hot meal. I don't reckon he was any more specific. Psh, right. Well, the boy's crazy, but he ain't stupid. And I can see your gear is, uh, lacking to say if he asks. You tell him I gave you this. Uh, no char. Ah, Riggs is gonna talk my ear off if I don't send you over to him next, isn't he? Fine. Go see Riggs then. Tell him he can do whatever the hell he wants. You, again. Shit. You're sick. All right, so... What the hell is this... journey? Damn right it sounds crazy. But that's how I know you ain't lying. Fine. Well, the only reason anyone bothers me is because I'm good with it. So either I can modify your weapons, or we can find a more creative use for it. <laughs> Tell you what, maybe I could do something with it. help with whatever journey he saw you on. Just tell Wally to be more specific next time, yeah? So we're done here, right? Or do I need the hammer again? Can't say this has been fun. Uh, bye. Oh, friend. <laughs> Glad to see you're all right. That's right. But everybody calls me Riggs. I try to keep folks safe out there. 
Speaking of which, Bo mentioned you might need some help getting your feet back on, do you? We all help each other out here. <laughs> I don't suppose he was more particular about why. Right. Well, I've got a pretty focused skill set. I reckon I know what he means. Come to me if you ever need to upgrade your equipment. Ready to face anything. What do you say? Ready to see what's down there with me? Right. Let's see what dangers still lurk in the old ward. the handle to make it work. This used to be a research facility, cutting edge. We did things down here nobody dreamed of. Not before nor since. Yet, for all our manpower, we didn't know what the stones really were. Until it was too late. The stones? <laughs> the world stones. Giant red crystals that let us see into other worlds. Even trapped into them. So, what? We just hide the stones away and hope the Soviets hadn't found their own? <laughs> no. We had to know everything there was to know. It was a matter of national security. Of pride. So, yeah. We opened the door. And walked through. But something was waiting on the other side. It didn't happen right away. Hell, the inhabitants of the worlds we traveled to couldn't follow us. We thought we were safe. But yeah, the route found a way. After that, well, we all know what happened after that. Locked, huh? Well, this is my house. Come on. I gave Ellen a few things to hang on to. In case of emergency. Uh, she must have hidden it around here somewhere. Come on, Ellie, where'd you hide it? That red thing. We call it a dragon heart. Don't ask why. Take it with you. You might need it. Hey, take a look at that matchbook you found. I got a hunch. Let's get this door unlocked. Can't stand around all day. Stone. Yes. Or part of it, anyway. 
Every shard's as useful as the whole. We shut it down after Harsgard died. Like I told Ellen at the time, the damn thing's more dangerous than useful. Huh. Of course not. Uh, never mind. Now, let's see if that worked. Work to do what, exactly? to bury this place. Not just lock it away, but get some explosives and bury it in a tomb of concrete. More dangerous than useful, Traveler. Remember that. Ford? Ford? Ford! Oh, man. Bo is gonna be pissed. Woke it up. Clementine? Hey. Did he tell you how to use it? Do I even want to? System failure is imminent. The core has been compromised. The utility is required. Commencing acquisition. Ah! Help! Clementine! <laughs> Don't let go! Clementine? Board! Shit! Where are you guys? Oh, this is all insane! Both the crystal and Ford! Better get moving if I'm gonna fight Clementine. Primus, housework, to my fellow Drazir, all who live and may yet live in whatever days are still to come. My people, we stand together in ash and humility. We who have mastered space and time, who harness the very stars and perceive the threads of creation, now waver upon the precipice of a truth. Hmm. This looks important. We find ourselves both vital and insignificant. In the face of what we see, is it not the height of arrogance to be How can Come we behold such great and not be used to our knees? We are witness to the Whoa. It's over. Thank <laughs> you. 
Impossible. Where did you come from? How did you find your route? You should not even exist. They said to look for a tower with a glowing white orb. Shouldn't be too hard to spot. Yeah. Thank <laughs> you. 
That's over. That's over. Okay, this is it. Oh, <laughs> holy hell. 